since you're going to the Super Bowl this year, based on what you said earlier in the oh, week. Oh, man, cut it off, bro. Don't do that to me. <laughs> so, yeah, the, the, the question you were asked if the Niners, if this is a Super Bowl preview, you wrote, you think the Niners are going to the Super Bowl. It could be, let's see when the Super Bowl comes, whoever we play, they're going to be in trouble. Did you realize what was coming out of your mouth when you were saying that? Well, I just – I'm very confident in, in the squad, and I didn't think, first of all, that, that they would make a big deal out of it. Um, I was just talking to the local media. Um, but I, I really believe that we really have a legitimate shot to go to the Super Bowl. And they asked the question, so they basically forced that out of me. Uh, I didn't have anywhere to run. So I, I basically said what was on my mind. I really believe that we have a chance to be in the Super Bowl. And just like every other Sunday that we play or Thursday, whenever we go out there on the grass – it's going to be a, a hard fall battle when you're playing us. It's going to be a, it's going to be a hard time. What similarities are there between um, the two guys who are, appear to be in the one-two in the battle for MVP, and and he'll make his latest case tonight on Monday Night Football against the Vikings, Lamar and Russell, who you've played with? Yeah, uh, you know they're 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 very uh, versatile players, and then you know you can't really scheme for backyard football, so they both bring that to the table. And, and it's hard for defenses, especially when they they running and they tying that D line out, and you know for four quarters, that's that's a tough task. So what happens if let's play this out, since you did or the media, as you point out, open the door? What if you go to Miami, you're there for the Super Bowl, and it's Seattle across the way? What would that mean mm -hmm. for you? Uh, what, what would it mean? It would mean that I would have some film that I already, you know, simulated and played the game against this team. Um, I'm not going to make it a uh, Earl's coming home or Earl, I already did that. So I'm, I got that out of my system. That would just, it would just be Seattle. And she, I would prepare my butt off. The team would prepare their butts off. And she, we, we'll go out there and do what it do. What's it been like uh, to be uh, coached by John Harbaugh? How how have you? Because again, he's your he's the first uh, non Pete Carroll coach that you've had in the NFL. What's it been like? Walk me through that process here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Harv's he, he's cool. He, he's uh, it's been a smooth process. Um, his communication uh, with me has been great, uh, and that's that's all I can ask for. And other than that, you know, we just take it day by day. If some come up, you know, talk. If not, hey, I, and I'm I'm going on about my business. And uh, does this feel like a Super Bowl team? Again, you've been on one. You've been in a couple of them. I mean, does it? Do you have that feeling? Is this similar for you? Yeah. So, so Rich, I just I just went on a limb and told the media. We just have to talk about. I told the media that I feel like you know, we got to make it to the Super Bowl. So I definitely feel like this is a Super Bowl team. Like we have that it factor on both sides of the ball, all phases. Okay. So do I take that as another guarantee that you're backing it up again? Nah, see, I don't want no start that, man. It's just <laughs> conversation. I'm just having fun with you, Earl. For more of the Rich Eisen Show, tune to Audience Channel 239 on DirecTV for free on BR Live or download the Rich Eisen Show app.